Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Christina. If you are new here, thank you for clicking on my video and take a moment right now to hit that subscribe button before you leave. So in this video, I'm going to be blowing out my hair because it is time for me to trim my ends. So I decided why not film a video of me blowing out my hair, right? So I have already washed my hair, conditioned, deep conditioned, and I already have my leave-in in. Um, I did, before I did all of this, I did try an Aztec clay mask for the first time. So if you want to know my thoughts on that and you had not seen that video, I will put it up above in the cards. So all I did after I washed my hair was, you see that? That conditioner. <laughs> all I did after I washed my hair was put it in these plaits. Um, I do my hair, when I blow it out, I do my hair in three sections. I do two in the front, two in the middle, and two in the back. So, all I'm going to do is, and of course I always forget my clips. Alright, so all I'm going to do is take the two sections I'm not working with, clip them out of the way. Okay, so I'm going to be using this blow dryer right here. It's the red blow dryer, and it has this little attachment that comes off. This blow dryer, I got it from Walmart. I think I paid about $30 for it, and it came with like four different attachments, and this is the one that I like to use the most. Um, for my heat protectant, I'm going to be using this right here. I can get it focused. This is the heat protectant that I'm going to be using. I got this from my local beauty supply store. And then I am also going to be using this comb right here. So my hair is still pretty wet. That's probably because I put it in flat, so it'll take a little bit longer to dry. All right, so what I like to do is comb it through to make sure that it tangles out. And then I just take my heat protectant and I like to spray mine in my hand, about three. And I just rub my hands together and then I just like to rub it through my hair. I don't like to spray it directly on my hair. Alright, and then I'll comb it one more time just to make sure. Alright, and then I just start blow drying. Sorry about that, y'all. I just realized that I didn't have my dryer plugged up. <laughs> but anyways, so whenever I blow dry my hair, I I blow dry my hair on high heat. I don't do medium heat. I don't do low because with this stuff right here, if I do it that way, then my hair is not going to get as straight as I want it to. So I do it on uh, a hot, hot heat and I do it on like medium speed as far as the, what you call it, the wind, the fan, whatever. Anyway, so hot and medium, medium speed. All right, and then once I get done, I just comb it back through. And then I'll just flat it back up to keep it out of the way. And that's all I do. So I'm just gonna do that all over my head and then when I get done, I will let you all see how it looks.
Okay, y'all, I am done. Um, if you notice, when I got up here to this middle section, I did have to split it in half. I keep forgetting my hair is not as short as it used to be. So I can't do small sections. So I should have did eight sections instead of six, but I know the next time. Um, like I said, I do blow dry my hair on the highest heat setting so I do do hot because if I don't then it's not gonna get this straight like I want it to be and it'll be puffy and also it doesn't bother me to put it on the highest heat setting because I barely put heat in my hair I don't blow dry my hair all the time I don't flat iron it all the time so I, it doesn't bother me whenever I do blow dry my hair to put a little bit of heat in it but these are my results this is what my hair looks like after a I blow it out. So yep, yeah, that is it. Um, it is growing and it is getting longer. So I can't wait until it get back to the length it was when I was relaxed because I missed my long hair. But anyways, that is all that I have for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!